Welcome to the Numerology and Astrology for September 29th, 2021. If you add all those numbers together, you get the number 25. And if you add the 2 and the 5 together, you get the number 7. The number 7 is connected to the influences of the sign of Cancer and the Moon. It brings out the deeply penetrating emotions that seek to understand those things in life that are somewhat hidden from our normal view. Just because we do not see something does not mean it does not exist. With the number seven, the emotional energy draws a person to understand the patterns within themselves. Once we begin to understand the complex emotional constructs within our own psyche, we begin to become awake to the subtle patterns exhibited within others. The number seven wants to communicate awareness. In the negative, this number can indicate a person who is complex, unpredictable, temperamental, and somewhat fragile. It can be a person who needs to have things their way because of their insecurity and fear. Those unsure of how to embrace uncertainty will attempt to control others or the reality with their own perspectives and beliefs. This number can be protective and willing to sacrifice anything to protect what it believes or loves. Today, let go of old structures and places where you try to control others. Notice if you are simply trying to feel safe, then ask the question, in protecting myself so much, do I not, not see how it, uh, how it is happening for others or to others? Remember those that are the most afraid will also be the most defensive and tenacious. The astrology today. The moon tries to create a cloak of protection and defense today. Try to step back from so much fear. When the moon moves from a place of inadequacy and uncertainty, it tends to not trust anyone or anything. Venus and Neptune will trine, giving us a chance to trust others first before we judge, agree, or compete with them. There is an opportunity to finally see the best in others rather than the worst. A welcome relief for sure. A little pressure off others is needed at this time. Be aware this can take us into a position of idealism, so be careful to not make others into more than they really are. The spiritual potential today moves us towards more compassion. Let the beauty of life bring you to new heights of inspiration. While the material world is somewhat overwrought and clearly challenging, know that the Saturn Sun trine today gives us a chance to enjoy our emotional and spiritual selves. Use this energy to bring more self-awareness and a strength in our personal determination and directions. Stay the course, be grounded, and allow the stability to show you the path forward. We have certain limitations within, but sometimes learning to accept those limitations is the beginning of growth and a willingness to learn. Today can feel empowering and support better communications. My quote for today, in life there will always be strife. In love, there will always be those that feel unworthy of. In transition, there will always be a mission. In joy, there will always be those that annoy. In conflict, there will always be those that restrict. And in expression, there will always be those that want to make an impression. And my blog for today. We have so much to learn and, not, and so many do not understand that what they want may not be at their command. Wanting something to be a certain way will not keep the inner, internal conflicts at bay. We have to learn by not getting what we think. Life is not a genie that can manifest with a nod and a blink. Life is a process and a journey to become. Life is supposed to be a heart that beats like a drum. Life is supposed to take you away. Life is supposed to be a sensual bouquet something to taste and touch, something to inspire us to do too much. That is how we learn that fear is not a foe. Fear is a partner illuminating the pitfalls as we go. Thanks everyone.